Hey, love bugs. We are going to do the watercolor method today. Like, I'm so excited about it. So, I did use these two uh, these two different colors. I used the Ion Brights and I in the color Shamrocks. And I used the Adore um, semi-permanent stuff <laughs> in the color Limelight. And I am just going to use um, half of the Shamrock color. And I think I used two. I think I used two other Adore Me ones. I think I used both of them. I'm not 100% sure. And you just put it in this hot water and it's going to transform your hair. Now, I want to say this hair was sent to me by Dulago. So, shout out to you, Dulago, for sending me this unit. I will have all the information and stuff about it down below in the description box along with the products that I use. So, after sitting the hair in there for like two minutes, it changed. Like, I, and the lace did not get tinted whatsoever. And yeah, we got the color. Like, this is the perfect way to dye hair. Like, especially if you like the crazy, loud colors. Like, this is perfection. It takes no time whatsoever. But just make sure you have on gloves because I, from what I understand, it will dye your hands. So, make sure you have on gloves. So, I just let the hair sit in for a minute and that is it. I washed it out in cold water and... That is what I got. And you can see some highlights and lowlights because I did use two different colors. So I do like that. You can't really see it the way I the way it really looks in person, but and it's not quite that bright. It is bright. Don't get it, don't get it twisted, sugar. <laughs> don't get it twisted. It's joker bright, but it's not quite as bright as it came off. Okay, right here I'm just gonna be using some of my anti-frizz serum this is a, the next day after the hair has dried i let it air dry and i'm just uh spraying it on there uh to protect the hair from the heat and i am using my wand curler to curl this hair and i'm gonna be uh putting it in some pan curls and i'm gonna let the pan curl sit in there for a minute and yeah i mean you guys see <laughs> I'm going to let those pin curls sit like a day. I think, yeah, it was like a day. Because I wanted to do the hair on my off day. So that's what I'm doing right here. Now, y'all, I know this is not everybody's cup of tea. Like, sis, I get it. <laughs> I get it. Like, it is super, super loud. But I felt like it was really, really fun. And uh, trying this method was fun. So um, even though this color may not be everybody's cup of tea, just like... Uh, you know, take what you can from the video, from the style, and from and check out this wig. Like this wig is perfection, y'all. So yeah, even if you don't like the color, you can like just look at the style and and uh, the way that I colored it. You know, so right here I'm just showing you guys a better view of what I was doing, and it's just you know literally I am spraying some of that uh, spray on there, and then I am using my wand curlers to curl the hair. And like I said, y'all, this hair is phenomenal. It is so nice. This is some really, really nice hair. I am never disappointed when it comes to Dulago hair. They always come through. I don't know if I'm saying that right. If, if that's that's their name, like is it Dulago or Doligo? I'm not sure, but I like them. <laughs> I do know that. Okay, y'all, this is my Fruities uh, holding spray. And I'm just using that to... Um, to spray the curls i don't know if it's gonna hold the curl well at the time i didn't know if it was gonna hold the curls but obviously it did so this is just me uh fingering the curls out and y'all i really do like this method i will be doing it from now on <laughs> i like the curls that i received from doing this method y'all it like i love these curls oh yes honey yes and i really want to go for a, a pinup type look you know full hair just that was the look that i was going for so Right here, I'm just, you bet, you guys can see right here that this lace is perfection. I did not tweeze this hairline whatsoever. Like, the hairline is really, really nice, and the lace is just blended in. Like, it's nice. I had no complaints when it came to the lace whatsoever. Love it. Okay, so now I'm going to be using my Gots to Be Glue Free Spray, and, you know, you guys know, same old, same old, different day. So, <laughs> just spraying that on, and I'm going to adhere the wig uh, to my skin. <laughs> like so and i'm using my uh blow dry on cool settings y'all make sure you're using it on the cool settings okay so it, it will actually stick okay y'all and so i did my makeup and now i am trying to figure out what way i'm going to be styling this unit and i was like oh lord 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 hold, this hair is green honey you are the joker okay <laughs> And then later on, I decided I was going to be a watermelon. I am not going to be the joker, okay? So this right here is, um, this stick that I got from Amazon is bedhead. And it really lays down hair, like the hair around the parting space or wherever you want it to lay down the hair. And you can get it to, uh, you can use it to 
uh, prevent frizz or like flyaways. It's really, really good. And I will have a direct link to it down below in the description box for you guys because I love it. Okay, y'all. So I'm really just going to be styling the unit from here on out. Um, right here, you guys know I'm using my little trick to really blend in the, the lace. And I'm using my grandma hot comb per usual, okay, to lay that down. And at that moment, when I did that look, I was thinking, Lord, this hair is really green. <laughs> this hair is really green. But keep in mind, this is semi-permanent hair dye. It's not permanent hair dye. And like I said, it's just some fun to do. So right now, I want to have a feathery type bang. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use my shears and I'm going to cut me some layers. Right here, I'm just trying to curl it to see if I need it to cut the bang. And I am going to show you guys me actually cutting the bang. And yeah, like I said, the rest is just me styling this unit. Y'all, don't judge the green hair. You know, you live a little. Try, you know, try different things. I'm going to look like a cute little watermelon because I'm going to wear pink lipstick and everything. But <laughs> y'all, this wig is gorgeous, though. This hair is really, really nice. Um, enjoy the video. Continue to watch me styling. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And let me know if you guys have ever tried the watercolor method. Like, y'all, it is amazing and the fact that you can stick the whole wig in without it dyeing your lace is phenomenal okay y'all so enjoy the video and i will see you love bugs oh don't forget to like comment and subscribe and definitely don't forget to check out dulago here okay y'all don't forget don't sleep on dulago okay they come through okay <laughs> all of the information will be down below in the description box and i will see you love bugs in the outro bye <laughs>
you know what? I can't fuss about it. I can't complain about it because I complained about one color not being bright enough. And this color is as bright as they come. Okay? It's as bright as they come. Okay, y'all. So, let's talk about the wig for a minute. So, let's get into the fact that I did not have to tweeze this, this wig whatsoever. And this is what it looks like. Now, granted, the parting space could use some tweezing, but it's not terrible whatsoever. But this hairline, sis. Okay. A moment of silence for this hairline. This hairline is bomb, okay? It's bomb, y'all. I love the hairline on this unit. So, I love the hairline with any Dulago wig. Like, I have never received a Dulago wig where the hairline was not freaking phenomenal. Okay, y'all. So, the colors that I use, I think I'm going to say that in my voiceover. So, I'm not going to reiterate it or re repeat it at all, okay? Because I feel like I said it. I'm going to say it in my voiceover. But... I did use that, and you guys saw all of that, and this is the color that we got. Like, I feel like maybe uh, this wave is over, but I am somebody that's not really trendy. I am somebody that kind of go with uh, what they like, so, yeah, sis. Okay, so the only thing I did with this wig was um, I did use my chi irons to curl the bang area, Everything else, um, I did use, like you guys saw, I don't think you really saw me, uh, cut, curl the bang area the last time. I, you did see me curl it some, but that was prior to me cutting it again. I did decide to cut the unit, uh, the bang area again, just so I can get the real feathery look that I was going for. And yeah, and we're here, sis. We are here. So, I like the wig. I have not received any, oh, well, okay, let me, let me stop lying. I have received a little, little bit of shedding, just a little bit, just a little bit of shedding. I have not received any tangling whatsoever, and the wig fits to perfection. Everything else is perfection with this unit. I love it. The color is a lot, even for me, but, uh... <laughs> just call me Nicki Minaj, honey, because she gon' she gonna wear it, okay? She gonna wear it. <laughs> I didn't think I was gonna wear it, but I think I'm gonna wear it, okay? I think I'm gonna be that chick that everybody's looking like. And some will like it, and some will hate it. But who cares if I like it? You know? You know? You know? Anyway, y'all. Okay, so let me give you guys a full 360. This is obviously the unit in the front. I don't get, need to give you guys a lint check because... This is all the hair. I don't know how it looks in the back. If it looks a mess, uh, please forgive me because I didn't really brush out those curls. So, forgive me. So, this is the unit in the front. This is it on the left side. This is it in the back. On the... This is it on the right side. If you're wondering about my brows, I did bleach them. Okay. They they look lighter on camera than what they are. Like, they're not this light. But I did bleach them. So, yeah. And I use Sally Henson bleach stuff to, to bleach my eyebrows. In case any of you guys are wondering or if you want to bleach your eyebrows, that's what I use. If you have anything else that you use, comment down below, sis. Comment down below. But! that ends this video i hope you guys have enjoyed i hope you like my joker hair my grinch hair i hope you like it and if you guys want to see me do the watercolor method on any like with any other colors like if you have a color preference like say i don't like green but i want you to do such and such comment down below we, we're gonna we're gonna do this this whole thing we're gonna get this whole thing a try because i am that girl that will try any color okay i will try any color so, if you have any preferences, something that you, a color that you want me to try, comment down below and we will give this thing a try. And yeah, that's the end of this video. I love you guys so, so much and I will see you guys next time. Bye.